If humanity suddenly disappeared, how would the Earth change? The very moment humans disappear, vehicles in operation will immediately lose control. Subways will rush forward aimlessly, airplanes will fall from the sky, and cars will collide with each other. The entire transportation system will be paralyzed in an instant. Ships docked in harbors will drift with the ocean currents, and running trains will derail. One day after humans disappear, power grid control centers will cease operations. Apart from scattered dim light from solar energy, the world will plunge into darkness. For the first time in hundreds of years, the Earth will truly go completely dark. Air conditioning systems will stop, elevators will halt between floors, and water and pipes will lose pressure. One week after humans disappear, food will begin to rot. Pets, driven by extreme hunger, will start to escape from homes to find food for themselves. Stray dogs will gather in packs, wondering where humans could have gone. But pets like cats and parrots, trapped in cages, can only silently await death. Fish in aquariums will gradually die as no one changes the water or adds oxygen. Supermarkets and stores will become havens for rats and cockroaches to multiply uncontrollably. One month after humans disappear, underground water pipes will burst, flooding the ground with enormous amounts of water. Even more terrifying, without human intervention, nuclear power plant reactors will go out of control, causing devastating harm to nearby life. In the following time, widespread radioactive contamination will directly impact the global weather. Temperatures will drop sharply and massive, weeks-long blizzards will sweep across the globe. Radioactive dust rising into the atmosphere will form a veil, blocking sunlight. The nuclear winter begins. Six months after humans disappear, satellites in space will begin to gradually fall out of orbit, hurtling down and burning up in the atmosphere. Animals on Earth will witness this spectacular moment, like a brilliant meteor shower. Vegetation will begin to invade urban areas. Plant roots will penetrate cracks in the pavement. Vines will climb the walls of buildings. One year after humans disappear, plants will start to break through waterproof surfaces. Cities will return to the wild. The civilized cities that humanity spent thousands of years building will erode, and predators will begin to return. Deer will wander the avenues. Wolves and foxes will hunt among abandoned buildings. Bears will rummage through restaurants for food. Birds of prey will build nests on skyscrapers. A new urban ecosystem will gradually form. Five years after humans disappear, highways across the globe will gradually be reclaimed by green vegetation. Nature will demonstrate its astonishing resilience and begin to regain control of the planet. Steel bridges will begin to rust severely. Hydroelectric dams will deteriorate. Some small dams will break, releasing natural water flows. Rivers and streams will clean themselves, the water becoming crystal clear. The air will be significantly cleaner. The ozone layer will gradually recover. 20 years after humans disappear, cities will be almost completely covered by plants. The skyscrapers we were once proud of will largely become animal habitats. Old growth forests will begin to form in areas that were once suburbs. Leopards and lions will roam freely on the streets. Sparkling glass buildings will now be covered in moss, their glass panes shattered. Fifty years after humans disappear, vehicles will be corroded and covered in rust. Many tall buildings, unable to withstand the pressure, will begin to collapse. Corroded steel columns will no longer be able to bear the load. The skyscrapers that were once a source of pride will tilt, then crash down. Cities near deserts will gradually be swallowed by sand. Las Vegas and Dubai will be buried by sandstorms. Concrete will crack due to invasive plant roots. 100 years after humans disappear, the global climate will have undergone a magnificent transformation. Some low-lying coastal cities will be submerged. Venice, Bangkok, and New Orleans will sink into the sea, becoming artificial coral reefs. Meanwhile, the oceans will be revitalized and marine life will thrive on an unprecedented scale.
with no more overfishing, populations of whales, sharks, and sea turtles will rebound. Coral reefs will recover vibrantly. Rainforests will fully restore their area. 500 years after humans disappear, even perfect man-made structures like the Eiffel Tower and the Golden Gate Bridge, lacking technical maintenance, will become severely damaged and could collapse at any time. Steel cables will gradually snap, and bridge decks will give way. Then, one day, they will collapse with a terrifying roar. Most buildings will have disappeared, leaving only ruins covered in green moss. Cities will have turned into old-growth forests. One thousand years after humans disappear, iconic buildings that have stood for ages will gradually collapse. A glorious civilization will be erased, piece by piece. The Great Pyramids will still stand, but their outer casings will have peeled off. The Great Wall will still exist in some sections, but many parts will have collapsed. Angkor Wat and Machu Picchu will be penetrated by tree roots. Modern cities will have completely vanished. New York, Tokyo, London, Paris will be just dense jungles. 5,000 years after humans disappear, Earth's environment will have undergone a massive change. The air will be fresher, life forms more abundant, and animals will begin to dominate the Earth once again. CO2 levels will return to pre-industrial levels. The ozone layer will be fully restored. Biodiversity will explode. Millions of new species will evolve. Meanwhile, the traces of human civilization will be erased by time, with almost nothing left. Most plastic will have decomposed, with only scattered fragments deep in the soil. 10,000 years after humans disappear, concrete will have disintegrated, and steel will have long turned to dust. Will we still be able to see any remaining traces of civilization? Perhaps some fragments of the Great Wall and the Egyptian pyramids will still exist. And of course, the global seed vault in Norway. Ironically, all the achievements of modern civilization and high technology we are proud of, all the culture we preserve on paper and in cloud storage, will turn to nothing in just a few hundred years. We once thought preserving civilization through carving was foolish, but now reality has given us a painful slap in the face. 10,000 years is unimaginable for humanity, but for the Earth, it is nothing. The Earth has existed for 4.6 billion years. If you scale that down to 24 hours, 10,000 years is less than 0.2 seconds. Tens of thousands of years ago, our ancestors paid a great price to become the victors among countless species. Today, we finally stand at the top of Earth's food chain. Yet, in just a few hundred years since the Industrial Revolution, we have covered the Earth in wounds. Perhaps we were truly wrong. We have never understood one thing clearly. The Earth will only be better without humanity. But humanity can only face extinction without the Earth. Today, countless species disappear from the Earth every year. The Earth's usable resources may not last another hundred years. If we continue on this path, it won't be long before the disappearance of humanity is no longer just a hypothesis. I hope more people see this, for the sake of our descendants and for our own future.